Good morning. It's good to see all of you again today. Yesterday we had a short devotional from 1 Thessalonians 3.12. And we saw in there that if we grow in love for all people, that God would cause our heart to appear before him holy and blameless. In other words, he would be pleased if we did that. Today I want to add to these thoughts. In Proverbs 14.31 it says, He who oppresses the poor shows contempt for their maker, but whoever is kind to the needy honors God. And again, Proverbs 28.27, He who gives to the poor will lack nothing, but he who closes his eyes to them receives nothing. When Paul went to Jerusalem to report to the other apostles all that he had done among the Gentile churches, they encouraged him to keep doing his work. And Paul stated in Galatians 2.10, he said, They all said, is we should continue to remember the poor, the very thing we are eager to do. For the last two years, my Betty and I have worked with other church members in making sandwiches for the homeless in our community. We make around 150 sandwiches every other week. Tom and Bethany White are now in charge of this ministry. Because of the increased demand created by the shutdown ordered by the governor, the church has been asked to provide 300 sandwiches every other week. The Whites and the crew are taking care of that increased demand. We would like to ask you to help them provide an extra blessing. Would you and your family consider baking lots of homemade cookies? This can be a fun activity, and I know the people who receive this food will really appreciate it. Now, there are important rules to follow when you do this. Wash your hands, number one. Number two, wear gloves and mask when you mix the dough. Number three for the children, no licking the spoons and spatulas and then putting them back in the dough. Trust me, Miss Betty has to remind me of this every time I help her make cookies. Number four, no no no-bake cookies. All cookies have to be baked. Number five, please put them in Ziploc bags so we can safely handle them. And number six, be sure and add lots of extra love, and the people will know it. If you're not able to make um, cookies, then try making face masks. I've already called some of you up, and you're already on your sewing machines working. So Friday between 12 and 2, I'll be at the church building to receive any cookies you want to drop by. If you're not able to make it, then give me a call, and I'll stop by your house. If you are listening to this video and you're not a member of the West Main Church, we would love to you to partner with us in this activity. And if you want to provide cookies and face masks, we encourage you and we would really appreciate it. So please have a very blessed week. Enjoy yourself. Have lots of fun. And we'll see you Friday. Thank you.